What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you guys my everyday makeup tutorial, kind of my new routine lately on what I've been doing. Something that's quick, easy, but I still feel put together. So if you guys want to see what I do, then please keep watching. Hey guys, okay, so I'm starting off with my face primer, which is my L'Oreal Magic Lumi and my Urban Decay Makeup Setting Spray, and I'm just kind of applying both of those. And then I'm going in with my Maybelline Fit Me Foundation in the shade 110 and the shade 220, and I'm mixing both of those together depending on how tan I am that day or how light I am that day. So I'm just mixing those both together, and then I'm applying that with a foundation brush. The next thing that I'm doing is I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light and my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the shade NC15 and I'm applying those in layers to highlight and conceal areas of my face. I'm going to be blending those out with my finger and then I'm going to be using my, my Target version of a beauty blender and I'm just using that damp and kind of blending that out. The next thing that I'm going to be using is my e.l.f. under eye setting powder and this is perfect for those creases that you get with concealer underneath your eyes and this just totally diminishes all of them. So I love this stuff and I'm just applying that. And then I'm going in with my Wet n Wild Coverall Pressed Powder in the shade, I think, Porcelain and I'm using that to highlight my under eyes in between my brows and my chin and my nose. And then I'm just using a little bit of my Maybelline Fit Me Powder in the shade 120 and I'm applying that all over my face. Next I'm doing my brows and then I'm going to be going in with my MAC Soft Brown Powder and using that, or my MAC Soft Brown Eyeshadow and using that as my transition shade. And I'm using a fluffy brush, this is from BH Cosmetics. So I'm just applying that kind of above my crease and blending that towards my brow bone. And then I'm using the shade from L'Oreal Endless Pearl and applying that as a highlight underneath my brows. Then I'm going in with my favorite shade of this look. It's Amber Rush by L'Oreal and it is a perfect rose gold. Perfect little pop of shimmer for everyday look makes you feel put together, but it's not too much. Then I'm going in with Brown Script from MAC and applying that into my crease and kind of deepening up this look just a little bit. Then I'm going back in with my fluffy brush and just kind of blending that out a little bit just to make sure there's no harsh lines. And now I'm up close just kind of showing you what I've done so far and just showing you a little bit more of the blending and deepening up the crease and then also bringing that down to my lower lash line. Now I'm just blending that out with some more soft brown from MAC. And now I am curling my lashes and applying my Colossal Mascara from Maybelline in the shade Very Black. And I'm just getting ready to put on false lashes. So I'm using my Lash Grip Glue and I'm using lashes. I think this is 
Perfectly Glamorous from the Salon Perfect brand. And I'm just applying that with my fingers. I feel like that's the best way to apply it for me. The number one tip I have about putting on false lashes is just make sure that the ends are down and you're good to go. Now I'm going in with my Too Faced Chocolate Soleil bronzer and I'm applying that as a contour and also a bronzer. It's the perfect shade for it because it's not too warm so it still can chisel out your cheekbones but also add some warmth to your face. And I'm just applying that along my forehead as well. And I'm just blending that out. Now I'm using my Milani Luminoso blush. This is new and I absolutely love it. Or it's new to me, but I absolutely love it. It's like a coral shade, but it's, it has a little bit of shimmer in it. And it's just so gorgeous. Now I'm just kind of blending that out with my fluffy brush and blending everything in. So now I'm going to be moving back to my eyes and I'm just going to be deepening up my lower lash line a little bit with brown script and applying a coat or a couple coats of mascara on my bottom lashes. All right, now I'm gonna be using my Morphe palette by Jaclyn Hill and applying the top four shades on the left-hand side as a highlight to my cheekbones, my nose, my cupid's bow, and the arches of my brows. And this creates the perfect highlight shade for my skin color and probably a couple shades darker than me and maybe a couple shades lighter than me. It is just so perfect and they're eyeshadows, but hey, use what you got. Now I'm just kind of sculpting out my cheekbones a little bit by baking my face with a little bit more of the powder that I have that I use underneath my eyes. Now I'm just blending out the under the lower lash line a little bit. After I apply mascara, sometimes things can fall, so I just like to blend it out a little bit more. And then the most important thing that I'm doing with this look is I'm not using wing liner today, which is so crazy. I haven't been wearing wing liner lately. I've just been applying black liner in my tight line and it adds definition and dimension and it makes it look fuller. So I've been loving that lately. Now I'm going in with my Rimmel natural lip liner and applying that on my lips. So I'm going into my L'Oreal lipstick in the shade Endless Love, and that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. end of my tutorial today I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below if you guys want to see anything else I'm thinking about doing other routines like nighttime morning stuff like that so I think that's it I'm going on vacation this weekend with my family so I probably will put this up in a couple days while I'm there or I might wait till I get back depending on if I have time so you guys won't know that until this is up so if this can explain if I'm kind of late it's because I'm on vacation so yeah oh do you guys like my nails I got them done and I'm trying out the coffin ballerina style nails and I am in 
love like I love them I'm so excited so yeah so yeah so I'm going on vacation with my family so I will see you guys when I get back and I hope you guys have a good week and I will talk to you soon